This is simply an organizational meeting of uh, the Camp Yard Commission, which was designed by uh, Camp City Council. And I'll go into a, a little bit of overview of the, of the committee and its purposes. Um, so we're not going to take questions. This is simply to meet, because a lot of us don't know each other, and to discuss uh, where we should add, what our goals should be, and the schedule of meetings for 2011. So I appreciate you being here. Uh, you're more than welcome to listen. And um, after the meeting, as I say at City Council, we'll probably all stick around for a little bit if you have any questions or information. Uh, I think I know why some of you are here, uh, because there is a concern about the safety of our water asset, but uh, and we'll talk about that soon. And thank you all for being here. I appreciate the fact that you've all volunteered uh, to participate in what I consider to be, and I, I think I share City Council's view and the administration, probably one of the most important <coughs> undertakings that uh, we're going to have certainly in the foreseeable future, and that is uh, how we can transform this amazing asset that we possess, this uh, vast water supply, into jobs. That's really the goal of this uh, organization and this uh, committee. I'll just go around the table. I think everybody knows everyone, but if I'll start with Tyler, if you would introduce yourself and and then we'll uh, make some informal remarks. Tyler Converse, and I'm the Water Department Superintendent for the City of Kim. Danny Sonier, Kim the Chamber of Commerce. Joe Martuccio, Kent Law Director. Mary Strelly, Kent Council Member. Warren Price, Director of Public Service. Chris Smith, Kent City Council, Board of Work. Dick Price, Private Citizen. I'm Dick Mendori, Ennis Mendori. We're involved in the City Council. What assets do we have in this community? What do we possess in our community that will reinvigorate, renew uh, what we all know is a community that is struggling, as most communities across the country are? But our community is, is suffering, our community is struggling. It hasn't always been that way. Uh, we're not in the 20th century anymore, we're in the 21st century. We have entirely different challenges facing us in this century than we did the last. The two things that I identified after some consideration and thought were the incredible skill of our citizens as far as skilled labor is concerned. We have historically been a dominant manufacturing area. Um, we have developed skilled workers. Um, they are intelligent, they're educated, they're trained, and they're enormously productive. I think uh, certainly Dick Price can speak to that. So that's our first, and, and to me, the most important asset that we possess as a community. But that's slipping, because we're losing the jobs that we had in the 20th century. The second thing that we have, which I think is going to be critically important in this century, is water. We have one of the most abundant, clean, dependable, reliable, enormous supplies of water, uh, more so than almost any other area in the United States. And looking into this century, looking beyond our time, uh, I came to the conclusion, and I think most of you all would agree, that water will be more precious than gold, will be more precious than oil. And it will be absolutely necessary because without water, we literally don't survive as a species. And without water, you cannot basically do anything from a manufacturing perspective. So it was the goal that we had to set up this water commission to look at the supply of water that we have and to report back to city council within 90 days to give them recommendations and uh, our report to start using this abundant, God-given supply of water that we have to leverage that into the creation of economic development and most importantly, jobs for our people in the 21st century. Not only the people that are here, but attracting people from all over to come to our community to work and to 
raise their families. So that's basically, in essence, our charge.